Joe Budden has thrown shade at Lupe Fiasco over the Chicago Natives rap remix of Andre 3000's flute album. Last week, Lupe made good on his promise to remix the Outkast rapper's debut solo album New Blue Sun, but Budden for one, is not a fan. Speaking on his podcast, the former Slaughterhouse rapper said, Hey Lupe, man, stop. Stop it. He rapping over them damn flutes. I cut that shit right off. As one of his co-hosts started playing the remix, Button joked, Oh Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Yo dog, it's women listening, with vaginas. Please, he continued, why would he do that to that to them? I can't say nothing, cause he gonna diss me, that was some bullshit. That was some clout chasing. Last week, Lupe Fiasco posted a clip to X, formerly Twitter, of him rapping over the intro song from Andre 3000's New Blue Sun, I swear, I really wanted to make a rap album, but this is literally the way the wind blew me this time. Some of the lyrics over the beat include, I prefer Kintsugi pottery over pristine, perfectly weaved sophistry slash I'm Bodhisattva possibly, cause being bothered don't even bother me slash but not a Buddha, cause I ain't got the modesty slash what you miss mentally is how much I catch bodily. Days earlier, he had tweeted, gonna rap all over that Three Stacks album and put it in the time capsule, for future generations. The food and liquor lyricist has a history of rapping over eclectic beats. He once rapped over Radiohead's The National Anthem for his mixtape Enemy of the State and also performed along with Kanye West and Pharrell over a beat that heavily sampled the band's frontman Tom York's solo single, The Eraser. A couple of weeks ago, Andre 3000 surprised the music world by announcing his debut album with just a few days' notice, then shocked it further by revealing the project was entirely instrumental and based around his playing of the flute. In the press release for the album, Three Stacks divulged why he would not be rapping on the album, which marks his first full-length release since Outkast's Idlewild in 2006. There's this misconception that I just won't do it. I think people feel like I'm sitting around on rap albums, or sitting around, and I'm just not putting them out in that way. And no, it's not like that, he said. In my mind, I really would like to make a rap album. So maybe that happens one day, but I got to find a way to say what I want to say in an interesting way that's appealing to me at this age. Despite the lack of a solo rap album, Andre 3000 has continued to contribute guest verses on tracks for the likes of Kanye West, Future, Frank Ocean, Killer Mike and a tribe called